Hey, it's Mab. It's Wednesday, May 12, 2010. I want to take a look before the market opens here in about 15 minutes at Juniper Group. It's an OTC bulletin board stock trading under the ticker JUNP. Um, I don't know a ton about this company. What's caught my eye is this uh, the whole the whole candle pattern. It's got it's not a definitive, but it's got a a triangle look to it. And there's a pretty good support level in there. I'll come right back to. CJUNP when it, when it made the pinch, just a, a real big move, didn't hold, came right back down. I'm looking to wonder if this is a true bottom for this stock is what is what I'm wondering about. The indicators are all kind of getting into uh, the oscillations aren't as big now that they're, they're tightening up, making me wonder if this is going to try and make a move or not. Uh, rate of change still right down there. Real real quick lesson: rate of change is just used for finding historic lows. That's how you use that. Um, it's still above the historic low. Usually, look for if it comes down here. You're looking for uh, it would be considered, you know, an oversold level. Accumulation distributions in a pretty good downtrend, but the chart itself, I won't leave this on here, but just real quick, the chart itself is in a pretty good downtrend overall. But it's getting some positive divergence. With, with some of the indicators throughout this downtrend. That's why it caught my eye. Taking money flow, you know, right around zero. You can see it's, it's tightening up. It's, it's, it's staying right in that area. CCI in good shape. Tricks with a, an uptrend towards zero. Want to see it make a turn now and hold this. We want to see it dip down and put this into a downward channel. We want to see it make a move and continue this upward channel. Let that be stronger. Uh, RSI is obviously in good shape right here, all three together, which I like to see pushing through 50. Like I say, the the I wouldn't necessarily put this there. I think a more realistic trend line is somewhere right around through there. There is no uh, real, real strong trend lines for for this chart, but it just has this triangle feel to it. And the important thing is. If this was the true bottom, it comes down, it makes a new high or low, and is it going to make another high low right here and try and make a move again? Look for a couple things to hold. That area right there around, I think that's about 0075, is a pretty good support level. See, it's up around 009 today. A penny is always a resistance level. It's just, it's just the nature of the beast in, in technical trading. Um, you can see it's actually at a resistance level right now at 009. Um, other than that, it's stair stepped around quite a bit with the bouncing around. Look for that penny to be a resistance level. Then you want to see it come back through and challenge that area right through there. Historically, it was a, a support level that fell through. It's come up several times and hasn't been able to wick through it here, held above it here for a couple days. It's just had a hard time with this level right around, uh, that must be around 01. Uh, two five somewhere right around there. Look for it to challenge that, and then possibly come later on. That's it's going to be its first real, real resistance level I see outside of the nine it's at now. And then down the road you're going to be looking for it to challenge you know the the two cent mark. But that's you know down the road. Right now it's look for it to push through nine, which was a little bit of trouble for it. And let's see it go up and challenge this zero one two five area. Um, most importantly, let's see it hold this. This is a good area for, for entry right now. If it's going to hold volume at 617,000, you see it's actually drying up. Um, I haven't looked. I'm not sure how many shares they have in their float or anything like that. Uh, but we want to see more volume come, come pouring in here and see if it can take out, you know, zero, zero, 009 and then take out that penny range. Uh, always be smart at this at this level. You know, gains can come from a percentage standpoint, hot and heavy. They'll come fast. Always be smart and secure your gains if you're in. And this is going to go up. At least take some off the table and see if this thing is going to keep on moving. Anyway, this is Map. Taking a look at JUNP.